everybody, it's Kirsten from Lambie's Nursery. Now, getting your very first reborn is expensive and getting those accessories to help bring them to life and help enjoy them more are also expensive. But this is such an exciting time. When you get your first reborn, that's all you wanna do is like go out, go shopping, get some really cute stuff for them. I get it, I've been there. So this video is all about how to get stuff for your reborn for under $20. How do you get those essential things for your reborn? Well, first we're gonna start off at Walmart. I love the baby section at Walmart. They always have so much cute stuff and a really great and wide selection of all kinds of sizes. Always super cute. Walmart always has really cute and really great deals on their sleepers. So I'm gonna pick out this pink and yellow sleeper and it is $7.44. They also have these super cute onesies for $3.78. Next up, we'll need a blanket, and there's this really cute solar system blanket for $4.86. How cheap and how cute. I'm not totally sure if Walmart will have the pacifiers I'm looking for. I'm looking for like pacifiers for super, super cheap, like a dollar cheap. I'm not sure if Walmart will have those. And it looks like they do have them. And these are so, so cute. I really do like these and they're a dollar. I am looking for the Walmart brand bottles. I'm not sure if I'm gonna find them. I don't see them, but they're usually only like a dollar or two dollars. Mm, oh, here they are, perfect. I love these bottles. They have so many designs and colors and they're just super cute. So I'm gonna grab this one cause I love it. Most important thing to remember though is to remember to bring your husband so he can carry all the things while you film about the things. Now let's go check out the Dollar Tree, see what they have to offer. It is always so important to like compare different stores, compare the prices, and let's just see if they have anything cute. I know we already spent our $20, but maybe we can do a comparison. All right, now we're in the baby aisle and Dollar Tree always has some really cute stuff for babies. It's not robust like Walmart, but it's still so cute. We're back from the store. We got two bags, one from Walmart, one from Dollar Tree, and we ended up spending about $26, but that is still really cheap. So the other $6 came from the Dollar Tree because I just really wanted to like compare what you can get at Dollar Tree versus what you could get at a place like Walmart and if there's any differences in those items, but still you can get some really good stuff for really cheap. So Gracelyn is here and she's gonna help me like show this stuff off. Let's start with what we got. This is our Walmart haul. This is what we were able to get at Walmart for under 20 bucks. So we were able to get this cute um, solar system blanket, super cute with like elephants and planets. We got this Gerber onesie with like leaves on it. We got a butterfly sleeper for nighttime, a matching butterfly bottle, and then two pacifiers. And here is our Dollar Tree haul. So we got her this cute little lamb stuffy. We got her a bottle, a teething toy, this adorable bib, pacifier, and a fleece blanket. Here's everything we got for $26. That is crazy. 
So I know everybody's idea and definition of essentials for reborn baby dolls are different, but for me at least, I consider the essentials a pacifier, a bottle, a blanket, and two, three outfits. And that's about it. Those are the essentials to me, but I know to other people it's different. And I like what we got at both places. It's really hard to pick just one because like at Walmart, I couldn't find any bibs that I liked that were in our budget. Whereas at um, Dollar Tree, I found this really adorable bib. And like the blanket for this is super thin and not great, but at the same time, she's just a doll. She's not gonna get cold. Um, I love that we were able to find something like a teether at Dollar Tree. But this bottle we got at Walmart is adorable. Same with the sleeper and the onesies. These are just gorgeous outfit pieces. And Dollar Tree doesn't exactly have clothing options. But then again, I got a pacifier with basically my puppy dog on it. So... <laughs> Both places are great to get stuff for your reborn baby dolls on a budget, but you shouldn't and don't have to stop there. You can go to thrift stores, antique shops, Facebook Marketplace, Craigslist, eBay. There are so many great places to find all kinds of things for your reborn baby dolls on a budget. Now, I know for some people, 30, $20 to $30 is still not it's still too much money and they don't have it. And for those people, I deeply, deeply apologize if I have offended you in any way. This is just tips and tricks. Um, if these tips don't work for you, I'm really sorry, but you can find tricks that work for you. You are only limited by your imagination. And that is the great thing about this hobby is how we can all use our imaginations to do such amazing and wonderful and fun things. So, if this, if these tips didn't work for you, that's okay. And if these tips did work for you, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, please. And let me know, because I would really love to know if you guys like videos like this. Maybe we could do some more. Anyways, I hope this was helpful, especially to those who are new in the hobby. You don't have to get super expensive to enjoy this hobby. I really didn't. I, so when I joined this hobby, that's when babies Babies R Us was closing, so I was able to get so much stuff on clearance. And that was so much fun. So don't forget to like check clearance. My Walmart didn't have anything um, newborn size on clearance or else I would have grabbed it. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so, so much. And I hope you have a great and fabulous day. And don't forget to stay safe out there. Bye, guys.